Yes, yes, my son, Biggs, a.k.a. Tim Sexy. Welcome to Sign of the Client. Today I'm going to do Moogs and his new tune, and it's called Different. Um, I'm a Moogs fan still, like, like, from the, can I say from the beginning? Yeah, man, I feel like when it was Mowgli. Um, I feel like Mowgli's got, like, Moogs has got his own style of music, like, the way that he raps, his own flow. I feel like it's unique, and I feel like at the time he came out, Erdington in Birmingham had so much other like rappers coming out and I feel like he was he was on his on his game the most and I feel like yeah 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 I seen like potential for this brother to go somewhere and when he got signed I thought you know what I had a feeling it was coming I feel like he's, he's young he's got the he's got the followers that are like yeah they're feeling him the older people are like okay yeah yeah man yeah man yeah man like I don't think anyone I don't think I've ever heard anyone say a bad thing about Moogs you get me so it's just like when it comes down to this music thing, I feel like yeah, yeah, and then I, I think he took like a little break, like that, like this time last year. I'm sure he was on like a little hiatus. Then he come back this year with a few tunes, and everything I've heard so far has been decent. So I'm gonna get into this one. This one's called Different. Let's see if it's certain different or if it's that pain rap. I hate that disclaimer shit. <laughs> The reason why I hate that disclaimer shit, bro, we know like it's a music video, like obviously it's entertainment for those that don't see it as entertainment, well, depending on what brothers say, but come on, man, that disclaimer shit, it's like the, um, the fucking, the platforms and that, like, hey, bro, this brother's about to say some fuck, Chris, we're not associated with this, like, we don't know if he's talking out like, real shit about what, the bodies that he caught last week, we don't want none of that shit, bro, bro, disclaimer that motherfucker, but yeah, Moe's different, let's go. Forest beats. I always tell the truth, nah, no, I need to lie. Cause nowadays I only money, need a peace of mind. My girl told me more, you need to leave the streets behind. But I've got beef with some niggas that need to die. Call me MJ, all these cases that I be in. My life's worth more than what these labels are screaming. Wheeling and dealing, I get that shit. Hey, right, that there. Aye, right, my line's worth more than what these labels are screaming. I feel like that's probably um, that's probably one of the issues that a lot of guys from the road are having. Like, the record labels are probably coming, but the numbers that they're probably getting on the roads, boy, don't really add up from these labels. So some of these labels just step their fucking game up, yo. If you want some of these artists, like, and you believe in their work, I right, sign them for the real P, bro. Fuck Get me. That. I like that hey, chain that like my man's got. What is it? Was that Kirby? Is that say Kirby? All right, mate. Raw man still got a trap line in his hand, you know. Man, I ain't letting this shit go, bro. This could ring at any time. Nah, bro. We're just gonna. Nah, bro. Is that the brother that was from Nietzsche's? Um, I don't know him particularly, but I know a brother. Um, shout out to Levash. That's a that's a brother from the ends that that was definitely definitely his little guy. Um, yeah, man. Shouts out to Crow. If it's the same one, I could be wrong. My apologies if it's not, but rest in peace to anyone that's passed away in 2020 or in general, but it's been a hell of a year for some of us. Hey, everybody is dressed up, ready to lick a move. Give the pass, Give it all we got. Rest in peace, crew. That shit don't feel real. I free my nigga poke, I is really in the field. I shot my nigga Oka, I was really on the drills. Right now it's right, you slip up, you get killed. Uh, I can't show them how much packs that I run through. Cause these niggas bums looking like they bun food. I pass the board to my nigga, let him run through. And I'm that nigga in the hood, do one two. She be driving in the far, yeah, I caught through. She keeps snapping up the dash, said it's not cute. <laughs> Do me a favor, please. Get out I of hate here. them girls there, you know. They just Get love to snap here, up man. everything. Shit, I, I, I swear, I dislike them. I feel like it's a younger generation of women, though. Like, you could be in the car, they're snapping the music, they're snapping the steering wheel. If you got wood grain on the dash, they're snapping that, they're snapping outside. Bitch, it's windy. Close the fucking window. Look how my hat nearly come off my fucking head and that. Nearly shot my bold patch. Come like, on, man. 
Come back in again. Yeah, I can't through. She keeps snapping up the dash, said it's not cute. My girl's stressing about them girls, babe, they're not you. I'm hearing rumors on my name, and it's not true. Four pockets full like a baby over here. Got you woman crush when they're moving crazy over here. Big hammers, we ain't playing over here. Told that bitch she can't chill, cause she's playing over there. On P, how much key that nigga moves the weed. I ain't camping in my raps, man, I do this in my sleep. I know the pack's dog, niggas telling me it's green. I gave it out of work, cause that pack's coming cheap. The drillers and the trappers show me love Cause I make sure the straight whatever is going off Yo, I'm in the birches with all my jewels on I spent all this trap money on some tools on Yeah, I can go crazy drop I spent all my trap money on these tools done I just feel like as an artist, as a rapper Like if you're, as you just said If I'm just rolling around with all my jewels on I just feel like, I, For one, you just look like a light bulb And for two, you just gotta be ready for the smoke Because I don't know about no other city, but in Birmingham, if you just see a man just jeweled off it, you just feel like, yo, unless you know him, it's going to look like baby food and you're just going to want a tech piece, no homo, but I just feel like, ah, oh. it looks good sometimes in the, in, the, in the videos, like artists having bad jewelry, but sometimes I feel like, do you wear that on the roadside? Because that's be a headache if you do, you know, I'm telling you, big facts. All the drillers and the trappers show me love Cause I make sure the straight whatever is going off Yo, I'm in the birches with all my jewels on I spent all this trap money on some tools on Yeah, I can go crazy, drop a bag in the door Or I can walk up and leave and go and shut down the store I ain't in the industry, I'm really in the field Never hear a single chick, but I walk past Camille I don't know why all these rap niggas got this big ego Cause if you couldn't spit bars, you might be on zero And I ain't fucking with a nigga saying on the fence The two sides to the team, pick one of them I what was that bar? What was that bar? So like, I ain't hit a cracker in a minute. I that man there like stay punching up the fucking fiends. Nah, you don't do them things, man. <laughs> you do not do them things. I don't know how these crackers even come back to bed for surveils and for the. Oh, I saw man. Let's. Hey, let me hear that again. Slap a minute, the rapper out of live it. Truth be told, I ain't had crackin' in a minute. See the mind of my prison, stuck up in the system. Yeah, we the same thing, but I just need to get him. Earthbrush, you know. I just be a little different, I hate it. Man, I love you. chain there looked like there was a bite taken out of it. Is that supposed to be like an apple or something? Let me go back a little bit. I'm trying to figure out that chain there, like, what is, uh, I don't know what that is. Let me see a proper. platforms shouts to Hector that directed this all right so that was Moog's different that wasn't Moog's yeah definitely that was Moog's different I feel like um that was a tune that I usually expect Moog's to actually make um I don't think it was anything different from what he usually makes but that's not a bad thing because like, as I said, he's never made any sort of meaty shit. He's never made some shit tunes. Like, I feel like Moogs has got, like, a, a high level when it comes to this rapping thing. Um, the visuals, I like the visuals. I feel like most of Moogs' uh, visuals this year, though, has definitely been, um, like, on the block. A lot of the man them usually got, like, nice whips in there. Obviously, he's got the jewelry. Jewelry games look like he's a mad thing. I feel like... Anybody ever remember when um, Link Up TV did like um, nah, nah, the levels to this shit out here? Yeah, board where they had like it was based on levels. jewelry, so like Mist had an episode. <laughs> Zaha, well, for Zaha nah, had, had an episode. Nah, it's gone mad. I'm sure Big Nasty had an episode. I think it's something to do with drip. But yeah, you know what? Some of these Birmingham artists look like they've got a bit of a collection going on. You know, I feel like Rashid needs to fucking step on the M1 and come down to Brum and get that shit cracking. But yeah, man, uh, would I sign that one? By Moogs, you know what? (sighs) 
All right, with that tune there, I'm, I'm stuck between do I sign it or decline it because I'm thinking to sign it because it's a decent tune, but I'm declining it. I would decline it also because it doesn't stand out. It, as I said from the beginning, it's not really anything different, even though it's quite different, no pun intended. It's not much different from anything that you've heard from Moogs before. I'm not saying every tune that every rapper makes should be something different, but I feel like there should be an element to it that's, that that makes it a little bit like... So you know what? Um, do you stick with a sure thing or do you want something different? What do I want from Moogs? Do I want something different? I think I do, you know. And not just because of the song title. I, I kind of, beforehand, I kind of wanted something different. Um, even though the tune's called different. You know, I'm going to have to decline it. I feel like Moog's tune different. I'm gonna have to decline it. Just because I want something different, like for the tune to be called different, and don't get me wrong, Moog's has definitely tried some different shit. Like um Round and Round like a Merigo. Was it called Mer was it called Merigo? Round and Round? Is that what called Round and Round or Merigo? Like that tune when he got signed was like a real up tempo tune and it was like, whoa, that's a bit too much though, Moog's. That's a bit too much to the left. But he tried it and then he was like, nah, 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 nah. And then he just went back to his normal shit. And I feel like this is obviously, I feel like Moogs is playing it safe with his music, which as I said, it's not a bad thing because your listeners probably know what to expect. They love your music regardless. But me, I feel like I like when artists kind of have something different, kind of switch up, you know, not really their flows, just just to be in it. So yeah, that was Moogs different. Uh, my sign of decline, myself, Biggs, aka Tim McSexy and I'm out.